Hello everyone. Today, we are covering the 5 best serrated bread knives on the market, which are the best for you considering some unavoidable factors that you might miss out without watching this video. Here, we are going to give you an impartial review to find the best from a plenty of irrelevant products. For more information and updated pricing of the products mentioned in the video make sure to check the links in the description below. So, let's get started. Number 1. Our best pick for the money is Mercer Culinary Millennia Wide Wavy Edge Bread Knife. This is a great knife to own, but the blister packaging needs serious rethinking. It requires a really sharp blade to open a package that contains a really sharp blade. That's fraught with danger. But the knife itself has good weight and balance, and a particularly grippy surface at the handle. They have thoughtfully rounded the heel of the blade at the bolster, so that even if a finger strays from the grip, no one gets poked. Similarly, it has a rounded front tip, no point, which makes certain sense in a bread knife. This behaves as if it were a much more expensive knife. Perhaps that can be attributed to the lesser number of serrations per inch, just three, and their rounded design. The knife sits easily and safely in the hand and made quick work of everything we tested. At first the rubber grippiness of the handle seems like an advantage, too, but we suspect the material might degrade and get sticky, especially if you get lazy and toss the knife in the dishwasher once in a while. But enjoy the grip while it lasts and the price-worthy knife along with it. Number 2. Our second best pick is Victorinox Swiss Army 10.25-inch bread knife. This knife has a reliable blade and a handle that is especially secure and well-shaped to the hand, with a nicely curved bolster. Victorinox touts it for its extra utility as a spatula for bakery icing and slicing, and suggests its slightly curved blade edge is more effective. It's a knife you can use for just about anything and not worry too much about whether it will survive in the long term. Anything? Yes. Its 4 per inch serrations cut into crusty bread well enough, even though it did require some small amount of effort to make the actual cut. And yes, it does serve as a spatula for both peanut butter, great when making sandwiches en masse, spreading and slicing with one knife, and for icing a delicate cake. This is a good, solid knife, with a handle that is especially easy to keep hold of and has balanced weight. Its raw cutting ability could be a bit better, but for routine and multi-purpose kitchen use, it's perfect. Number 3. Our third best pick is Shun Classic 9-inch bread knife. This knife isn't flashy, but subtly beautiful, and a delight to hold and use. The polished wooden handle is crafted just so, with a subtle D shape you can see by looking down from the butt end of the knife. It's nearly invisible, but you can feel it when you wield the knife. The blade does all the work, cutting through crusty bread as cleanly and easily as you would ever want. It just glides through, with few crusty crumb eruptions, does equally well on softer breads, and slices a very soft, juicy tomato without the least rip or squish. The blade has very little flex, but in this knife, that seems to work to my advantage. Its design is also proof of the fact that fewer, and in this case quite rounded, serrations are in many ways more effective than the craggy serrations you see in some knives. At 9 inches, it's also an argument for a bread knife of more modest length. It's far from a bargain purchase, but Sean will own a serrated knife when it needs it, at no cost. So, if properly cared for, this is a knife that will be in your kitchen for decades. That makes it worth the cost difference against any number of more disposable bread knives that will never work as well. Number 4. Our fourth best pick is Mercer Culinary Bread Knife 10 inch. The Mercer knife we list as best budget pick also comes in a version especially designed for left handed users. All the other admirable qualities of the knife are the same, but the design of the handle is reversed, which will be welcome for any southpaw who is tired of having to adapt to a right-handed world. A priceless feature for some, and a very good knife. Length, 10 inches, material, high carbon steel, sandoprene registered, polypropylene, weight, 6.4 ounces. What we like. Comfortable handle. Inexpensive. Medium weight. What we don't like. The handle gets sticky. Number 5. Our fifth best pick is Dell Strong Bread Knife. This knife is visually impressive and comes with a heavy duty sheath, a keeper, which is handy. It's arguable that its design leans male rather than female, heavy black blade, heavy black handle, heavy black packaging, etc. 
That weighty design is evident in the knife itself as well, and it's heavy with a full tang, reasonably well balanced overall, but the sharply angled finger design of the bolster might not accommodate smaller hands well. The blade stayed stable and unbent, and it sliced well, but the weight of the knife itself put lots of pressure on the soft loaf. With almost 4.5 really pointy serrations per inch, it didn't cut as easily as knives with fewer or rounded serrations. For fancy looks, it can't be beat, but it might be overkill for a humble, or elegant, loaf of bread. So, grab yours while you can. Make sure to check the links in the description below. That's all for this review. Feel free to share your feedback. Like, comment and share our video. Do subscribe and hit the bell icon to get more videos like this in future. Thanks for watching.